Natalie was just telling me that these uh, sweltering temperatures have her cranking up oh, the air conditioning. Yeah, everywhere. Is your car's air conditioning up for the extra work, though? Our Monday morning mechanic, David Rogers, joining us live with tips on maintaining your car's air conditioning system before it breaks down. Hi, David. Hey, Natalie. How are you doing? Hi, Good. Tom. Hi. Hey, uh, you know, with the air conditioning today, uh, we have a couple of different kinds of refrigerant that people are using. And, you know, typically your system is supposed to stay sealed. You're not supposed to lose any of that refrigerant. But the fact is, after two, three, four years, um, it does begin to leak out a little bit. Porosity of the hose, you know, the little tiny holes in the rubber. When you have to recharge a system or when it's not blowing cold enough or you don't feel it's working efficiently, it's critical, first of all, that you have the system tested. First of all, the law requires it. Um, and then in addition to that, your pocketbook should probably require it. Refrigerant today costs a, an amazing amount of money. Um, we have two different kinds. One's called R12 and one's called R134A. First thing that we do in our shop when we do an AC system test is we test to make sure that the refrigerant is pure. And the reason we do that is with the expense of refrigerants today, some people are actually installing fake or phony refrigerant. Um, in some cases, we, people have filled cars up with hydrogen. And, you know, as, as we all know, hydrogen is an 80 mile an hour vehicle is pretty much a bomb. Um, we've also found propane in the systems, all kinds of things. So it's really, really critical. First of all, you go and see a certified technician um, in an accredited facility and you have the thing performed by somebody reputable. Don't go for the cheapest service you can find. But I will tell you where you can save some money. If your system takes the older type refrigerant, it's called R12, you can have your vehicle retrofitted. We can change a few of the components, like this is a receiver. Um, we can change a few. Hey, David, we're having, uh, we're having some problems with your microphone, so we're going to have to cut it short there. Right. But, uh, yeah, it's too bad, especially people probably getting ready to run the AC Maybe today. Needing it. Yeah, we'll try to get some of those tips and pass them along, though, from David, because he always has good stuff to tell us. Maybe we were using the AC power uh, to power his microphone. <laughs> That's what it was. And it was yeah, yeah, working a little too hard. Possible. Well, later today, the U.S. kicks off their first match of the World Cup. We'll also be checking out a tough day for the Rockies and their fans. Yesterday at a Coors Field, highlights, lowlights as well. Coors coming up in sports. Brought to you in part by Sprint Business. Sprint Business. Yeah.